Okay, hey guys, sorry about that. Um, uh, this is Android16 here. I'm gonna be doing a playthrough. Hi! Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna be doing a playthrough of ever. Hey! Ever one! One! Yes! Yes! One. Yes! One. Yes! I'm gonna okay, be doing a playthrough of Everlasting play, Summer. We'll play your league. We could. With. Let's go. With. Okay. Um. Juan and Ethan. I'm gonna be reading this story, and they're gonna be commentating on it as with me. So. But the thing is, is that they will be able to, they will be making the decisions. So. Uh. Let's stop chatting and let's get right into it. Now I'm gonna skip the intro. Because this takes 20 minutes. Over the ground, and I don't know, guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this because we, Ethan, E Man voted on Miku, but Bugs and Juan voted on Elise, so we're gonna go with Elise. Unfortunately. And. Uh, now. Okay. Ow, my ears. Ow! Ah. No, the bus sounds. Okay, so. Guys, do you want me to read this again? Since Okay, for all you viewers out there, we, we tried to record this once already, and the recording failed. It so, failed on us, like... It, uh, okay, like, okay, like you're... Oh, okay, never mind. But anyway... So... It failed you like you're dead, Juan. <laughs> That's what I was about to say, but <laughs> okay. But anyway, so do you guys want me to read this, the beginning part? Yes. No. No. Do you want me to skip to where we decide on? Yes. Okay. Yes, decisions. We're gonna skip decisions to the first decision. I'm sorry, all you viewers, but we've already been through this, so. That's all you, I just okay, do I reply or do I do not reply to? Reply! Don't reply! Yeah, don't reply. Be the rude person. Yeah, okay. be that jerk. Okay. I was frozen in astonishment. The girl looked perfectly normal, just like an ordinary human, but I still could not urge a single word. Utter. It. It's too late to run. Pioneer girl. Did I say something wrong? <clears throat> Took a monumental effort to answer. Uh, Seaman. Um, yeah. Seaman. Seaman. Pioneer girl. What? Seaman. Seaman. I owe nothing. I just. I mean, I've just arrived. I replied quickly, I beginning the. What? Young I'm I'm beginning trying. to worry that I might have blurted out something wrong. You did. Pioneer girl. All right then. Welcome. She smiled broadly. Strange. It looked as if I had just a normal girl in front of me. Bah! I shouldn't have returned here. The woods and fields seem better. But that. But what shall I? But what shall I do next? Trying to. Sp Try to speak with her as if she was a human, or run away, or what? The blood was pumping unbe unbearably in my head, tearing it apart from the inside a little bit more, and the poor pioneer girl would be splattered with the gruesome contents of my skull. Pioneer girl, what's so funny about that? There we go. The girl looked over at me. I s it sent shivers down my spine, and my knees started to tremble. Seaman. No. Seaman! Nothing. N -n nothing Pioneer girl. Great, then. Great. What's so great about that? You Suddenly... <laughs> Suddenly, a thought crossed my mind. To H-E double hockey sticks with it. Forget about the bus behind me. The fact that it was winter yesterday and summer today. I want to rip off my itchy sweater and just accept that this is yeah, actually just happening. Yeah, all your clothes because it's getting hot here, so you have to take off all your clothes. <laughs> exactly. I have bought one. Okay. Everything is as it should be. All is for the best. Oh, by the way, for you viewers, I will probably be uploading League of Legends videos pretty soon. 
Yeah. So. <laughs> We're gonna see you rage. <laughs> what the frick was that, Ethan? <laughs> uh, you know, I am earlier. I was in the car and yeah. I imitated Eric when he was laughing with his voice cracking. It was like. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Your mom was ready to slap you, right? That's my grandma. Oh. <laughs> oh my! Oh my! She better had her hearing aids turned down. I'm actually just kidding. I don't even know if she has hearing aids. I'm sorry if she does. No. Okay, good. That's offensive, you know. Uh oh! Oh, I'm sorry. Andrew. Yeah. You're not a friend anymore. What? You. <sighs> Andrew. I'm kidding. You're my friend. <laughs> I know. Simon! How would you Simon! happen to know? Simon! Hey, 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 Slavia, do I see my Simon? <laughs> do you want some Simon, baby? <laughs> We're not talking to you, Ethan. No, I'm, yeah. no, I'm not talking, talking to you either. You know what? I'm not talking to you either. I just muted Steven. both of you guys. Screw you guys. <laughs> oh I God. muted all of you. <laughs> I even Pioneer muted girl. myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Pioneer Girl, you should you should go to our camp leader. She'll tell you everything. Well, ah. Master E. Jackson says now. I think he muted you. Okay. <laughs> I muted everyone, even myself. Get wrecked. Screw you. Get wrecked in the yeah, booty. The look, Pioneer Girl, look. You go straight ahead to the square, then Jackson turn left. Master e. You'll see several Jackson. small cabins. I almost broke out of my voice to say. Mm -hmm. Type in chat. Gosh darn, Ethan, you have chat for a reason. Andrew? What? Yeah, that's why I'm on curse. I'm trying to game. Oh. I'm trying to game too. She pointed yeah, exactly. at the, she she pointed at the grass gates as if I knew it was behind them. I almost said grass. Oh yeah, she pointed at the grass. I knew no, it was I behind. Said grass. You did say grass. What's the grass? I know. I know, but it it would sound like this. She pointed at the grass as if I knew it was behind them. <laughs> yeah, I knew it was behind them. Dirt. No, it's under them. Hit. Behind grass is more grass, and then more grass, and then more grass, and then more grass. Oh, yeah, I, okay, I get it now. Pioneer girl. Well, you, well, you can ask someone where Olga Dimped Cabin is. I just want to call her since that, that name is way too hard. Oh, of course, I could ask my mom, but I don't know. Simon! I, erm, um, got it? Of course I didn't. Pioneer girl. Well, I've got to go now. Good go leave forever. Leave my life. The girl waved her hands. Her hands. Her, she waved her hands. She waved her hand at me and disappeared through the, through the gates. It seemed as if to her I was something ordinary. All of this. <laughs> you're ordinary. <laughs> you're just ordinary. <laughs> <laughs> She doesn't oh. like you. You're not a special person to her. You're just ordinary. I know. That's I'm just boring. All of this should... Sh what is this? I found a sticker with a number three on it in my chair. You know what? Read the game, not your chair, okay? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. <clears throat> all this show all this show with bus and the travels while awake or sleep while we're traveling only to me. While well, everything here is just, it's the way it should, should it be. Camp Leader Pioneer Uniform. What are they doing? Are they, what? Are they doing a historical reenactment here? I wouldn't find Lennon standing atop an armored car in the square. Vladimir! Vladimir, the blood period pool. A period? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, Ethan! You know how they put like the little like info sheets on the League of Legends while it's loading? Sure. What if they put that his last name was Lennon? Vladimir's last name was Lennon on there. Oh my gosh. It isn't. Uh, oh, it isn't? What's his last name? I forget, but it's in the war. Oh. 
But even that would not surprise me now, right now. After standing alone for a while, I, head I headed into the camp. A mere 50 meters ahead, a small one-story house popped up to the side. The sign near the door said, Clubs. I was about Clubs? to come forward. Like tampons? <laughs> what? Cl what did I say? Did you hear clubs? Plugs. Oh, plugs. <laughs> no, I said clubs. But anyway, oh, Ethan, <laughs> make the joke. Make the joke you did earlier. Why? It's about to come closer when the door suddenly opened and a short girl wearing a pint of year uniform came out. What's a short girl doing in a club? Just stripper? Yeah, I know. It's true clubs. Uh, yeah. No. No. <laughs> No, that would have been better if it was a lease. <laughs> Where the heck is the pole? Uh, yeah. There's uh, there's a pole with a light on top of it. Why would she dance on that? I have no idea. It's a pole. It's <laughs> a <laughs> <The> pole. <laughs> Her pretty face gave me the impression of one suffering from for the fate of the whole of mankind with a truly universal sorrow. As soon as she saw me, the girl froze, as if frightened. I froze too, considering what was the best to do. To approach first, or to wait until she showed some initiative. Or maybe running away after all. <clears throat> Although the last option was constantly being suggested only by my self-preservation and think that at least that's what I'd like to believe. Not the worst human instinct, but far from the most logical. If the most, if this instinctive player of poker, if if this instinct played poker against a, against deductive abilities, the outcome will be predetermined. Okay, now we're at where we stopped, I think. And those <laughs> dictile abilities, or at least their symbolance. We're hitting me that there was no need to be afraid of this girl. Yeah, suddenly, cool. suddenly, someone, suddenly, someone steps, jumps out of the near of nearby bushes. I cannot read, and it's Yulia. Oh crap! I spoiled her name. Crap. A girl wearing a bright red T-shirt with USSR written on it. Such a perfect <laughs> reproduction of the age. What? She looked quite short from a distance and was probably younger than both Pioneer Girls. At least the one in the, the one at the gates and this girl at the door of the clubs. At last I decided to come closer, but the USSR, as they called her in my mind, jumped towards the first girl and started telling her something while wildly waving her arms. The other, the other girl seemed confused and lowered her gaze, remaining silent. I would have probably continued to observe their amusing dialogue, but the USSR suddenly pulled something out of her pocket and started waving it in front of the first girl's face. This something turned out to be a grasshopper. Pioneer purple. girl. Purple pioneer girl, which means it's Lena. Because Lena's name is in purple. Each, 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 um, each character has a different label for their name. Mine is just so happens to be purple, like her hair. Eek! Wait, no, eek! Or eek! 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 <laughs> <laughs> <Ichi> go home! <laughs> eek! The first girl squeed, squealed. Not, she must not be too keen on in insect. Insects as she instantly rushed off towards the place where Lennon oh. presumably made his speech about the I workers and like peasants <laughs> revolution. That is to say, towards the square. The USSR glanced at me, play grinned playfully, and dashed after her. Not a bad start to the day, I say so myself. I have absolutely no clue where I am. Besides that, there are some kids here role-playing as pioneers. As far as I can tell, this place is located, located thousands of kilometers away from my home. I am wrecking them so hard. Who are you, Juan? What are you, who are you playing as? I'm playing at? Jinx. I'm playing Jinx and I got two kills already. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Wow. Who's your support? Nautilus. Who are you playing against? 
Graves of Zillion. Oh dang, that should be easy. They're lagging. It that might even be a different reality. Reality check. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> and this was indeed a reality. I mean, everything around me seems so real, as if a little embellished, that I started. I was starting to think that, in fact, my previous life could have been a, just a dream. And what was? Am I supposed to do now? Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. I was picking up. I was picking at the cracked paving stones with my shoe and staring aimlessly at the club's building. Just a few more seconds before I have to come up, I have to come up with some decision. That's when I recalled myself rolling on the grass, weeping. I cringed in disgust. Perhaps it's another instinct when all of when all energy you for whimpering and what you cringe to the memes. <laughs> exactly. The memes I strong. I gave in to the power of the memes. Yep. Just gave in and said it's cringing. And you just said it's all 420 now. It's all 420. It's all 420. It's. it's... You're in Shrek Swamp. You must oh be ready. <laughs> <laughs> when all energy for whimpering and self pity use, is used up, the body either goes into hibernation or. <sighs> mobilizes its reserves. Mine seemed to have chosen the second option because, out of the blue, I found the determination to figure out what was going on. And in order to do that, I had to act like a man, or like a human, to maintain the dignity in, of the repre res representative of my own world. I followed the path to the left. On this side, on the right side, which stood small cabins, apparently the homes of the local pioneers. Actually, they looked quite cozy from the outside. Even though I was born in the Soviet Union, I had never been a part, been part of the children's organiza organizations. Neither the pioneers nor even the younger October children. I imagine the daily life of a typical of a typical pioneer camp a bit differently. Huge barracks with with a low r rows of metal bunks. Wake up. Call at six o'clock, played by a siren. One minute to make your bed, then joining the formation at the drill square. The minute man. Or oh my gosh. Yes. Or wait, could I just be confusing it with something else? But this is the this is Russia. This is Soviets. This is not America. This is not America. Suddenly, something something struck me on the back. I staggered, but regained, my remained my, on my feet, turned around, and prepared to fight his heroically for my life. And this is Alyssa. But all I found was another girl standing before me. My mouth hung open in surprise. What should I do for her? She's a hothead. So what voice should I do for her? When Act she's angry. angry. When, when she's angry, what should I do for her voice? Sound like an angry old woman. Okay, what should I do for her regular voice? Uh, I'm a calm person. Ethan, what's your opinion? Ethan! Ethan! Ethan, kick his butt! Ethan! Yes! We're killing peeps. Hold up. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, my health, my mouth hang, hung open in surprise. Pick, wait, pick your jaw up off the ground. That sounded too manly. Pick your jaw off up the ground. I closed my mouth. The same pioneer uniform, but the way she was wearing, it looked, let's say, provocative. I have no idea what that means. Oh my gosh, I needed that for the power! <laughs> Like all the girls I had met before, this one was rather cute. Oh, but oh, her overly so a arrogant expression killed oh, any go? desire to get to know her better. Pioneer girl. New here, aren't yeah. you? Uh, okay, semen, okay, dot, okay. dot, dot. Fine, see ya. She threw a threatening glance at me and walked past. 
I waited for the pioneer girl to turn a corner. Who knows what else she might have been up to. The most interesting thing was that even this hostile girl seemed completely n normal to me. I wouldn't think that at all. <laughs> she did not give either. off a f she did not give off the feeling of some deadly danger. By the way, she, this is a slutty one. Except maybe the danger of getting punched in the nose. <laughs> At last, I managed to make it to the square. There was no one in an on in an armored car, although this one. Is for them right now. <laughs> although one could easily ex expect something like that. After all of this had happened, Ethan, who are you playing as? Jack. Yeah. Jungle. I'm three zero, and one is five zero and three. <laughs> GG. GG. <laughs> I call GG. It's 11 to 4. Oh my gosh, yeah, that's GG. <laughs> I'm 5 and 0 and 3. 5 and 0 and 3? That and doesn't need to be there. 5 0 oh, and 3. Anyway. I said so and. Five and, and I'm not gonna say 5 0 oh, 3. That sounds like a freaking serial number. No, no, 5 0 oh, and 3. You said 5 and 0 oh, and 3. No. Oh my gosh, okay. You'll hear it in the recording when it's on YouTube. Instead, however, a monument to a certain comrade towered in the middle of, a, of the square. The letters on the pedestal read, Genda. Or Genda. Must be some fig big figure of, in the party. There were some small benches at the sides. It's quite pleasant here. Where did that girl tell me to go? To the Dragon left? One. Or to the right? Okay. To the left, to the right, to the left, to the right. And why am I going there anyway? All right, I've decided to, re to pretend to be normal. So to the right, through the small grove, I came out to the p at a pier. I'm I must have taken a wrong turn. Pioneer girl, hey, wrong way. I turned towards the voice, the first girl who stood before me. Pioneer girl. Now, wh now, what did I tell you? Take a left at the square, wasn't it? She had changed from her pioneer uniform into a bikini. Ooh. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> is, she, is she like, uh. How did she do that? Like, just instantly? Like, not just like instantly turned into a bikini? Crap, I can't. Can't take a. I can't take a screenshot. Crap. <laughs> Pioneer girl. Oh, I still haven't introduced myself. What the? F no! What happened? It crashed. Oh hmm. my gosh! I must have pressed something wrong. No, please! I haven't saved. Oh gosh. Ah. Uh. Well, that sucks. I'm going to set the recording right here. I will fix this problem, and I will get back with you guys in the next episode. So, say your, gu say your goodbyes, everyone. <coughs> okay, good, good. <laughs> that's a good <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> okay, so, and then I have to burp. But I it can't. So, all right. Someday. someday <laughs> okay. See you guys. Until next time. Close that program. Cancel. Close it. Oh.